Danny, what is it about that song? It doesn't matter if you're someone like me who never played high school football or these guys. It just, everybody feels something when they hear that song, even 10 years after it was written. What do you think it is? Um, well, first of all, thanks for having me. I think um, that song was more than a, than a hit record for me. I think that that was one of the songs in my life that it was a real moment in my career because it did, like you just said, Sam, it touched on so many uh, levels of uh, like the game, the people that played, the, the coaches, but not just the people that played, the players and the coaches. It touched uh, the lives of the families that lived this game with them. And, you know, Sam, I grew up, uh, as a lot of you guys know, I grew up in East Tennessee and we, we, as a community, we leaned on certain things. You know, we leaned on, we, all we had was school, we had church and we had sports and mainly football. So, you know, all the, all the things that come with that in your life was wrapped up into this song. And, and the first time I heard it, I knew that I, that I had, uh, that I had a song that was going to be very relatable to a lot of people in the way that I grew up and, and, and the things that, and the core values that, that I had, you know, as a child. Yeah, and you've done such a great job in your music, at, at making people feel something. I just wanted to know what it was like, though. Growing up in East Tennessee, we know where some of your college loyalties lie, but what about the NFL? What do you root for in the NFL when you grow up in East Tennessee? Well, you know, it's, it's it, when you when you grow up in East Tennessee, you don't have a pro allegiance to anyone. When I was when I was a kid, I, I really loved the Miami Dolphins because I just loved Bob Greasy. I, I, I loved him. Um, and then later on, you know, I, I there was a guy that graduated from the University of Tennessee named Stanley Morgan. And Stanley Steamer. went to the New England Patriots. He and did. that's where my love affair for the Patriots started because of Stanley Morgan and, and, um, but I, uh, and, th and then Sean got the job in, uh, in New Orleans and that led to me, you know, getting a suite and taking my father down there every Saturday. And, and, um, uh, boy, as, as y'all know, um, we had a lot of fun down there in New Orleans for several years. <laughs> yeah. Kenny, you had a lot of great times over at Gillette stadium. Um, I remember Vrabel telling me one, one meeting during training camp that you wanted us on stage to sing Back Where I Come From, and I swear I learned nothing during that day because I was just memorizing the lyrics. <laughs> you learned the song. Back Where I Come From. Song. And you, you've had so many, I mean, in the place where I were grazed, man. <laughs> Ticks in the cattle grazed. Oh, he's like still yeah, yeah. <laughs> Time passes with amazing grace. Come on. Here we go. But Kenny, the connections you made. Rex, you've had, you've had an I was on stage. on stage. Yeah, you, you I remember was your on, song? Uh, no, of course not. I was drunk. So, but I'm saying I had a few too many, I think. So I don't remember Kenny, but I remember Kenny came out to our practices and things, and it was it was great. But I got it. Why we got you here, Kenny? All right, and I got a tough question for you because this game is is brutal, man. I mean, Tampa against the Saints right here. We know Sean Payton and how close you are to Sean Payton. But look. I mean, I got to get an honest take on you. Who's going to win this game? I'm picking against my own son today. <laughs> so I'm throwing it out there. Kenny, what do you think today in this great matchup? Well, here's what I think. I got to just right before I went home with you guys, I got a text from Sean uh, talking about this whole thing. And he goes, I hope that uh, Cameron doesn't catch too many touchdown passes tonight. <laughs> so um, I love him, but um, I hope I hope he's not that successful. I think it's going to be a great game. I'm glad. Uh, I, I think that Thomas is playing tonight for the Saints, which is really going to help. I think it's going to be an amazing game. And, uh, um, you know, Tampa Bay has got a lot of weapons, but, the, you know, the defense is really good for the Saints. So I am going to go with the New Orleans Saints tonight. All right. All right. An official yeah. pick. I like it. Well, Kenny, we appreciate you taking the time. We appreciate you expressing what so many of us oh, feel so about you know, Randy, this game. Oh, yeah. Yes. What's up? Randy, I want to tell you, I, I played receiver in high school, and I was 5'6", and I got mossed every play. <laughs> <laughs> every play. That's amazing. That's amazing. Hey, man. Hey, Kenny, it's a pleasure, man. Appreciate it. Hey, Kenny, it worked out for you. You're doing all yeah, right. Doing we okay. can't wait to see you back on the road on tour, hopefully Great, soon. So. Thank you so much. We love you, brother. Great. All right, guys. Thanks for having me. Thanks, Thanks Kenny. Kenny. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.